Hello everyone and welcome to Chasing Adventures and today is going to be a quick update video on her necklace grill lights and giveaway information so make sure to stay till the end of this video. So I've been running her necklace lights for a while now and it's been working great and as you can see I still have my DIY version of these grill lights and so far I have no issues with overheating or turbo lag. However, like most of you who is powering these lights by tapping onto the fuse box has probably experienced the lights turning on randomly when the car is parked and the ignition is turned off. Because there were a lot of comments uh, on my last installation video regarding this issue. And I've also noticed that too. And that's because the fuse spot that was originally recommended gets power when the car goes into self-diagnostic mode. And you know, it's nothing to be concerned of, but might catch unwanted attention to your car if it's parked in the parking lot and someone with the bad intention sees it. And you don't want that kind of attention these days. And the owner of her necklace has also got lots of comments regarding this issue. So to address this concern, he tested multiple few spots and found one that works and won't turn on randomly. So I'll show you guys where the new fuse spot is and how to wire it. So first, remove the fuse box cover. And this is the old fuse spot that was originally recommended. And this is the new candidate for the replacement spot. And it already has a 7.5 amp fuse on there. So first, remove the 7.5 fuse and put the fuse that we just removed onto the lower slot of the supplied fuse tap. And put the fuse tap into the slot where we just removed the 7.5 amp fuse. And make sure you put the fuse tap in this direction. And connect the positive wire from the LED lights to the fuse tap power wire. And you don't need to cut or make holes on the fuse cover to close the cover. And the ground wire from the LED light gets tapped into this 10 millimeter bolt. So simply unscrew the bolt and put the ground wire ring on the bolt and tighten the bolt. And as you can see, all of my ground wires for my LED lights are on this bolt. And close the fuse box cover. and run the wire behind this cover and across the headlights and zip tie the rest of the wires and hide it behind the grill. And that's pretty much it. It's really simple to install these lights with the fuse tap and adds a cool look to the car. And if you want to see the installation process of these her necklace grill lights, I'll leave the link in the video description so you guys could view it after this video. And recently, I said as soon as we hit 10,000 subscribers, I was going to have a giveaway. And it happened rather pretty fast. So with the help from our good friend at Her Necklace, I'm going to give away a brand new, unopened Her Necklace grill lights for the 2024 Subaru Outback Wilderness. And this is the prestige option with amber LED lights and the wiring and hardware kit, which is valued at $187 with shipping. And to enter the giveaway, all you have to do is like this video, subscribe if you're new, share this video to follow Subaru owners, and comment congrats on the comment section. And follow Her Necklace Facebook page and Chasing Adventures Instagram. And that's it. And I'll also leave the details on how to enter the giveaway in the video description again with all the links. And one lucky winner will be randomly selected and posted on this video comment section. So keep your notification on too. So thank you all for your love and supporting our channel. I really appreciate every single one of you. And who knows, once we hit 20,000 subscribers, I'll do even bigger giveaway. And I'll continue to make more contents for you guys. So if you have any suggestions, please leave them at the comment section below. So good luck everyone. And thank you all for tuning in today. And as always, keep chasing adventures. And I'll see you all on my next video.